All right, Daniela, thank you. It is, of course, known as the biggest party of the year in Bakersfield. We're talking about Village Fest. Yep. It is a major undertaking, and this weekend they'll be celebrating a quarter century. 23 ABC's Josh Sanders spoke with one of the event's creators and shows us what we can expect. Frugatti's owner, Ralph Frugaletti's passion for kids has been on display for a quarter of a century through one of the county's favorite outdoor parties. Here we are 25 years later, it's stronger than ever. People love it, people look forward to it every year. They always ask us, why don't we do it twice a year? And I don't think they know how much work it takes to put one on, much less two. Frugaletti says Village Fest combines his love of beer and wine and a call to serve Kern County's most vulnerable. By coming to the event, you're supporting kids not just in general, not all over the world, not all over the country, but here in Kern County. 100% of the funds raised this weekend benefit the Children's Advocates Resource Endowment, or CARE. The local nonprofit raises money for local children's charities. We've given things to uh, the, 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 the Police Athletic League, the Sheriff's Athletic League. We've done the homeless shelter. Like We gave away like 300 pajamas to these kids that didn't have any at the homeless shelter. We, well, we turned the little sleepy Kern County Museum into Disneyland for one night. Mike Ramsey has been a part of the village Village Fest for 23 years, 22 of those as the mayor. Pretty much take care of all the setup and the logistics here on the museum. You know, all the all the equipment we use, generators, porta potties, fencing, stages. The event will house five different stages throughout the museum grounds with 15 bands, each bringing their unique sounds and genres from blues to island tunes. As Frugaletti reflects on 25 years of the festival, he's grateful it's made a difference. Um, you know, it's really neat to be able to see what it's become and what it means to the community and what it means to some of these charities to be able to get some funds to be able to do some things for these kids that otherwise they wouldn't be able to afford. And that was 23ABC's Josh Sanders reporting. Frugaletti said he expects 5,000 people at the event, running from 6 to 10 p.m. tomorrow. Tickets are $70 to $80. Include all your drinks and food samples along with the music. For information, go to our website, turn to 23.com.